This is the ingenious ACW536, one of the first Wi-Fi 7 access points on the market and we're going to open it up and see its main components. To do so, it's necessary to remove the four screws from the bottom section. And as you can see, it's fully metallic, which is excellent for a good heat management. But one of the four screws is hidden underneath a cover without any marking. Usually, when the manufacturers want to discourage the user to open a device, they write something like warranty void. So I assume it's blank since in the US, this type of warranty void sticker has no legal value. But it's still there for some reason. Anyway, after taking out the screws, I had to use a prime tool to detach the plastic top part and then we can see the antenna's pattern. To move forward, we need to detach the PCB in its entirety from the metallic bottom section. So remove all the screws from the sides. Then apply just a bit of force to detach the PCB since it's held by some thermal pads. It seems that the main components are on this side so I remove the aluminum covers and the thermal pads to see them. But to confirm that there is nothing of interest on the other side of the board, I detach all the antennas, as well as the metallic piece. And as you can see, I was right. So let's get back and see how well equipped the ingenious ECW536 actually is. You can pause at any time to see each individual component. That's it for today, thanks for watching and see you next time.